Well then, first trip out of the new year. Happy New Year to everybody. Uh, we've been quiet um, and are busy since October, November, so we've not done a lot of videos. We are out and about at, I can't see through my glasses. Uh, we're out and about in uh, near Brushes in Staler Bridge Reservoir. So we're going to put the drone up, try out the new Litchi app, and um, we'll see where we end up. Hopefully we won't lose it. Um, <laughs> it's a bit brave to bring it over water for the first time we're trying it, but we've uh, we've been playing with the settings and we've had a look at it, and it's not a million miles away from the DJI. Uh, not many people about, so we shouldn't get too much interrupted. Wish me luck. Let's have a play. So, uh, this is what we did. We uh, sent the drone up into the sun, up high as uh, about 393 foot. The birdie. Uh, it was all nice and smooth. The hockey sink uh, seemed fine at this point, and I did try recording it uh, with the screen recorder, but unfortunately that didn't work. So <laughs> that was the first fail of the day. But anyway, up we go. It's a beautiful, uh, beautiful sun. It's about um, three fifteen. Sunset today is uh, four fifteen, so we're just into sort of some good light. So we start panning round, and as you can see, the face four K. Um, that's what we're shooting at, and we'll do a full three sixty around. You'll see the colours. It's, it's a beautiful area where I'm allowed to fly, so we're quite lucky in that sense. A little play with a gimbal. Couldn't find um, the yaw and pitch speeds uh, within the settings. There is something there that uh, there is a your setting. I don't know whether that speeds things up or slow it down, but I'll have to have another look for that if I'm going to carry on using this Litchi app. Trying various things at this point. Uh, trying to set the uh, height of return to home. Trying to set the height, the maximum height as well for flying. And uh, at the end of this 360, um, when we go around, I'll show you the messages I was getting back from the app. Some lovely areas where we are in the northwest of England. Thank you. 
just see the little jerks. Um, this is what was happening on the screen as well. But there were a little bit more than just jerks. Uh, on the screen here, there's just been one. I think there's another one coming up. It just seems to stick. Now, the OcuSync is... Well, I'm directly underneath this, so it's, it's 393 foot in the air. Um, and if it's, if it's sticking like that there, that means there's a... Linkage. I wasn't in the car, I was outside of the car, so there was nothing between me and the drone. So that's basically the 360. Now, the other problems I had with the app while I was setting it up, and um, we'll just run to the end of this sequence and uh, it'll come up here I've put it in the end from the screenshots that did actually do tried setting the uh, height which um, it wasn't a problem eventually it did it it let me in then this is the main one this is the big one uh, return to home so this is what I've tried to do and it wouldn't let me do it this is the message I got which is worrying this is why um, I'm not going to be using the app. Also as well, uh, there's a calibration one as well that needs sorting out. So, uh, we had the Litchi app out today. Uh, it didn't really go down well, but to be honest, a few glitches as you've seen on the video. Uh, the biggest worry is the return to home point. If you can't set one of them, no point for me to uh, take off and fly. I have no trust in the uh, in the third party app. If you've got any suggestions, if there's something that I've missed or something that I've not done, and I've just been an idiot, uh, then uh, put it in the uh, comments down below and we'll have a fiddle and maybe uh, we might give it another go. I'm thinking of just leaving it until uh, there's a couple of updates or it just comes out a beta maybe. Um, other than that, we'll be sticking with the DJI and um, Fly, whatever it's called, app. And we'll um, wait for the Mini 3 to come out, which I presume is going to have all the gizmos and gadgets and bells and whistles that we require from DJI. At least then operating it won't uh, void your warranty um, or create any other problems. Hopefully the software will roll down as well to the Mini 2. Save us buying a 3. Can't see it though, can you? They're going to make us buy that 3. Um, 17th of April, I've heard. Not a big reveal. Just what's flying around on the internet, the last thing that I, uh, I heard. So, um, comment, subscribe, like, watch some more videos, do what you want to do. I'll see you soon. Keep flying. Stay safe.